Hi guys, I've just seen this news clip, like a news flash about Graceland being auctioned off because of a 3.8 million debt. I'm gonna quickly post it and then I'll do some research and do a proper video on it. So here goes, guys. Elvis Presley's home, tourist destination, and major landmark in Memphis is up for sale. A lawsuit filed in September 2023 claims the King's late daughter, Lisa Marie Presley, signed for and failed to pay back a $3.8 million loan using Elvis Presley Enterprises in Graceland as collateral. Nassani Investments alleges Presley took out the loan in May 2018 and had until May 2022 to pay it off, but they claim they haven't been able to get in touch with her since March 2022. Presley died last January. Fast forward to May 2024, this notice of sale posted in the commercial appeal. Lisa Marie's daughter, now owner of Graceland, Riley Keough, and her attorneys firing back in this complaint, saying it's all a fraud. Keough claims her mother, quote, never borrowed money from Nassani Investments and never gave a deed of trust to Nassani Investments, adding the company suing, is, quote, not a real entity, and documents allegedly showing Lisa Marie's signature on the loan and deed are forgeries. Adding to that, Keogh claims the notary listed on the deed of trust, allegedly notarized in Duval County, Florida, says she never met Presley and didn't notarize any document. Action News 5 reached out to Nassani Investments. We were told Kurt Nassani, who is listed on the complaint, was out of the country on, quote, family matters. We were also told, quote, it is the company procedure to collect on a default debt. Very, very interesting. And I wonder what news flashes you're getting in the country that you're in. Please let me know. Please comment anything you know about this situation with Riley Keough. Um, let's see how things unfold together. Thanks, guys.